Boys, I'm not gonna lie to you. I am a little bit nervous this morning. I'm a little bit scared because I can't lose today. It's a matter of fact. And you know, in can't lose situations, we as humans tend to get a little bit nervous. I know it's not just me, but regardless of how I'm feeling today, we have to do it. And I've been putting it off, man. I haven't played my team online in like four or five days. It's just the way things has gone since the last video I made, which was so long ago. Like, bruh, this, <laughs> I wish I could have a warm up game here, but we can't. So it is what it is. And ladies and gentlemen, this is episode 8 of season number 2 of NBA 2K19 spin to win and if you've been keeping up this could potentially be the finale we gotta win two games today and we clinch ourselves Larry Johnson and another season of spin to win now like I said last video I recorded and edited so long ago that I can't remember exactly what happened but all I know is we got two upgrades one of them was to claim Amethyst Giannis and put him somewhere in my lineup and the other one was to claim one Amethyst which is where the comment section came together my man Knicks fan use me as a, this series is freaking great button 161 of you used him as of this series is freaking great button i love it amethyst jason richardson at starting point guard i think that's actually what my opponent last video or the one before had so interesting thought amethyst kemba is a god you should definitely pick him up yeah that was an option too because i did say i kind of wanted to upgrade my point guard alec case has used the two bank spins for this video that is a really good idea which i'll touch on here in one moment Giannis at center replace elgin baylor with amethyst rudy gay i know you said get pg uh get a pg and these two are shooting guards but amethyst is Jimmy or Vince to start at small forward. Both are beasts. So many good options. Let me not mess around. Let me just show you what I decided to do. Jimmy Butler Jr. The third. I decided to throw him in the lineup. I've used him a few times in squad builders recently and he's so nice. Like we don't need to go through his stats but his 92 shot three plus lockdown defense made him a better selection than Kemba Walker at the point. I don't do much with my point guards anyways with this lineup and at least Penny can lock down on D. So yeah, I think Jimmy was the right move. Everybody always suggests that Vince Carter. Maybe he would be the move, but we're going with Jimmy today. And off the bench, as you can see, Amethyst Giannis, who was a player of the week reward, he plays really, really well at center. Like he is 6'11. He just he just does. I don't know why. Uh, I did boost his three to 68. It's not crazy. Uh, but his rebounding, solid, and he's a demigod, so it'll work. And as for the two bank spins, I'm not gonna use them. And that's because I felt such a bond with this team in this season. It sounds so cheesy, but like I want to win with Penny and Manu and Mark Gasol and John. Well, I, I want to win with these guys i don't want to just add another couple diamonds here so hey if we lose we still will have two bank spins for when we have to restart this whole thing but for now this is the lineup that's got to take us to the promised land i cannot lose today not an option and i'm really hoping it's just cosmetic that we won't actually need these two in-game challenge wheel spins but we'll give them a shot anyways and see what happens double double one player one spin two players two spins all right we can do that probably again hopefully it won't matter i won't need these spins shoot 70 percent from three have we ever actually completed that one i should keep track because i always ask this but regardless here we go with needing two wins and larry johnson will be mine and we will be ready for you guys know what will happen let's just go and here we go oh my gosh he's got okay he's got t-mac at point jason richardson he's already got his larry johnson and dan Issel. oh that's not the greatest lineup but he knows how to play 2k online <laughs> i'm scared i'm scared and i wasn't trying to make an excuse but it has been a few days since i played online i'm <laughs> i it shouldn't be shouldn't be a problem though let's go with manu ginobili fist 25 quick yep deep three to start the game that was actually a pretty good look oh good board marcus all that was so cheesy uh what he got it back though okay i guess it wasn't that cheesy he got it back i actually have good matchups defensively like i don't feel like uh he's got mismatches so if we can figure out the offense we should be straight uh defensively let's go manu inside yeah jump and one and one that would have been huge give me two free throws to get us on the board manu i just realized he does have a mismatch and that is his larry johnson at small forward uh my jimmy butler isn't uh he's a good defender but he's not that fast oh good move yes jimmy yes this larry johnson's lateral quickness really really low so i should be able to take advantage of him at small forward right now he's taking advantage of me but uh that's all good we always we always start slow i am a notorious slow starter okay he's kind of like got some off ball strategies going here this is uh this is interesting now he's on balling okay okay tom googs inside yes tom googs uh just drop step him and put it up and in yes tom googliata scoring on larry in the post i like now let me get a stop why have i not been able to stop this dude yet let's go yeah yep yeah, we're there we're there oh yeah good help mark gasol he is blowing by me with such ease i gotta get on this i think i might have to start off bowling until he gets over center because he is just hitting me i'll show you next possession he's hitting me with one quick cross and it's like it's curtains man it's so so odd uh let's go t-mac uh that's penny hardway ah, i should have gone up with that my bad my bad oh good look for manu ginobili from mid-range all right now let's play defense i'm just gonna off ball until he gets that this first move off right 
right there. Yep. See, see, we're there. Uh, <laughs> I off balled that whole possession, but we got to do what we got to do to win. Seriously, that's uh, that's the only goal today. Tom Gugliotta gives us our first lead. See, here he goes again, trying to get to the, yeah, see, he just tries to get to the rim on that first burst. Then I can go back into on ball because we can do it there. Yes, it all worked. Okay. I've already got my defensive strategy. We're starting to score. This is how we do it and spin to win boys. Okay, boys, pretty good start. I thought uh, I usually fall behind early, especially against relatively good opponents, but we are up by five. I think I have my defensive strategy figured out, which is most important. Kevin Martin or Kenyon Martin. If that was Kevin Martin, would have been a good shot. It was not. So it was a bad shot. Let's go Bob Pettit back inside John. Wall. Oh, okay. Turnover. My bad. All right, Giannis, I put you in the lineup for one reason and it's right here uh, in semi transition that behind the back move. Yep. Right to the rim. <laughs> That's the whole reason we put Giannis, even the Amethyst version, at point. It's too easy. But we got to get back to making some stops here. We haven't done that the last couple possessions. As Hidu just gets blown by. He made that. I actually contested that on the other side of the rim. Wow. Okay. Okay. I swear right now. I swear things are going terribly. Let's kick it back out. JR. No, no. I tried to bump fake that. Okay, wow. Everything's going wrong right now, and yet we're only down two. I take that. I take that as a dub here, boys. But I also take it as a we need to focus in here and not let things get any worse. Because, yeah, my opponent, he is good. So let's just, let's get to it right here. Bob Pettit wide open for three. Oh, that was, wow, that was a good contest. I thought he was wide open. Dang it, man. Again, only down two. I still think that's, you know, in a pretty good spot. Let's go. A few moments later. My starters are in late in the third. I usually like to have them subbed out, but we got... Marcus Soul with the takeover. So we're just going to keep pushing right here. Let's space the floor and this should be an automatic spin to the post. Thank you. Yep. I can get two or three, mm, probably two easy baskets here with Mark Gasol. Oh, give me that. Look at that steal. Yeah, get out of my way. <laughs> I'm cheesing. But why do you not look when you're throwing the inbound passes? Like that's, that's online 2K etiquette number one. Oh. Wow, I am, dude, my my defense is so sus today. Like, I don't even know what to say. But let's go again. If you double off, I'm going to beast and feast on you no matter what. Let's go, Marcus. That was, no. Wow, I just wasted my takeover move with that. That, oh, that was a steal. No, no. <laughs> the amount of missed steals I've had when he's had terrible passes uh, that he turns into scores is unbelievable in this game. Like, I swear. Let's go. Oh my gosh. I meant to pump fake. Dude, I'm throwing this game away. I am throwing. I just wasted Marcus Gasol's takeover with a couple terrible possessions. And now he's back within one. I'm whew, I'm a scrub. I can't believe what just happened. I shouldn't have turned my face cam back on. Things were going so well until I did that. Are you kidding me, dog? Let's go Manu to the rim. Yes. Back out. No, no. I wanted that to go to Mark. Thank you. Whew, okay. Dude, we still have a three-point lead, but now I have to run my bench for like the whole fourth quarter. That is not good. Oh, he's got takeovers everywhere out here. Man, I really, I screwed this up. If I lose now, nobody to blame but myself. Like, ugh, I wasted Marcus Gasol's takeover, and now I got my uh, starters tired. Just run the play. I don't want to, oh, I don't want to waste the clock. Uh, never mind. It worked. It worked because Manu's open, and he's hitting from three. All right, don't let him score here, and we got a three-point lead. Can't be mad about that, but thanks to my poor coaching skills, it's up to my bench now. Just maintain this lead. Like, my bench is good. They just kind of weren't so great in the first half. So, I'm a little bit concerned here. Yes, Giannis, that's an easy hoop. Great, Giannis, and one. Ah, uh, free throws. I'm feeling he'll miss one of these, but that's still okay. I'm trying to run one of these long plays for J.R. Smith. Takes a while to develop, but if you give me a good screen, Bob Pettit, we could be uh, we could be in business. No, we are not. It broke down. He defended that play so nicely. I don't even know what the other options are here. Uh, John Wall. Oh, yes, kick it out. Hito. That's an option that will work every time. Come on now. My play broke down. He knew when it was coming. He defended it so well. Uh, get back on D. Please, please. Yes, Giannis. Oh my gosh, Giannis got the cheesy. I don't even know. Is that a block? Is that a steal? Who freaking knows? Let's go. Let's take advantage. No wasted possessions here. Hito open in the corner again. Inside Giannis. Yes, big fella. Let this man Giannis get takeover too so we can attack the rim with ease. We're up seven. Oh my goodness, we just got another steal. Are you kidding me, Hito? Why not pop it? Why not? Okay, Bob petted on the glass. Bob petted out rebounding his man, Dan Issel. Oh, I would be raging if that happened to me. We are now up nine. The bench killing it, man. Now we need to uh, slow it down a bit. Like, I'm never going to really slow it down, but we'll run a play, waste some clock, and hopefully get a good look. J.R. Smith has been pretty quiet today. I am not going to lie, but if you give me a good screen right here. Yes, right there, Bob. Pettit, finish it. Finish it inside, Bob. Finish inside he knows i want to shoot with jr smith oh yeah all that hard work we just did and it's only a five point lead now it's all good those starters coming in they should be nice and rested jr smith can you please bless me by hitting a shot in this game no he really can't bob pettit this is not a good matchup oh what How? oh i thought i beat him 
He just played me. He played me and got the block. We need to stop here. We need to stop on this possession. That's a steal. Wow. I knew he was passing there too. I don't know why my voice is like this. Who was it? It was Bob Pettit that I think had a chance to make it a double digits lead in this game and he missed. I, uh, he missed a good look too. Let's go, Manu. Oh, Manu doing work inside. That's a terrible shot, Jay. What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm choking. I am choking this game away. Come on, Marcus Gasol. You clutched it for me in the last time we had a tight game. What? I was trying to do it. <laughs> Boys, I was trying to dunk there. I had a lane. How dare they not let me do that? Oh my gosh, Manu. No, I was trying to pass to Manu. Ha, ha, ha. What? No way, no way. That's contested. That is contested. Dude, I'm getting hosed. Oh my gosh, my heart is beating so fast. I literally can't breathe right now. This is this is not good. This is not good. I am I'm doing some really dumb things. Let's go, Marcus Soul inside. Please give me the finish. Give me the finish. Marcus Soul is so clutch in these tight games, man. And the steal. And the steal right there. Get it, Mark. Yes. I did it. I did it. I did it. I did it. Please finish. Please finish. Marcus Soul. I love you, dude. Yes. Yes. It just it's a pause mode. I don't care what you say. I love this man, Marcus Soul. He is carrying me, contesting the shot. We're done. This game's over. Let's go. I'm not even gonna lie, that game took a lot out of me. Like my chest is a little bit sore right now, but a nine point win. That's all we can ask for. This dude, Marcus Soul, 19825 steals. I was camping on the inbounds. Manu was good too. Giannis filled the stat sheets back up center. Dude, this is it. This is it. 11 and 0. I like our team. We're playing good. I'm warmed up now. We obviously have to play this last game now. And 2K, for all the times I've questioned why you give me trash opponents in this series, now just do it. I'm okay with it. I'm completely okay with facing a Ruby team, a guy who's trash. Bring it on. Oh, it's not going to happen. <laughs> I'm going to be against someone stacked. I know it. Moment of truth, boys. Moment of truth. Uh, okay. Okay. Pink Diamond AI, Pink Diamond Ben Wallace. Those are the two most trash pink diamonds in the game. We got this. We got it. We got it. Oh, and in a touch of dramatic or artistic irony, whatever it is, he is wearing the Suns jerseys that I wore during season one of Spin to Win in the game we are using to close out season two. Like, I, I love it, man. I'm just this confident. Look at 2K blessing me. Okay, that is that... <laughs> Good job, Jimmy Butler. Good start. But seriously, the one card that I know you can't go off with, the one really good card, is Pink Diamond Allen Iverson. Like, it's just not going to happen. Yeah, this Ben Wallace might feast on the boards a little bit, but uh, we can uh, we can try and stop him. No way, Kevin Durant. Okay, Kevin Durant. Fine. Two threes to start this game. Oh, no. He's trying to double team. No. Nope. You keep leaving Penny open. Eventually, he's going to make them. Yes, please. Bring on someone who's going to double team and think that's a good strategy. That'll make my life easier. And here we go. Are you going to bring the double? Okay, he's done. He's done bringing the double fair enough but uh look at this mismatch yep <laughs> get out here get your small body out here alan iberson and get dunked on ben uh ben wallace i couldn't think of his name there for a second i actually feel bad for this dude like he there's no way he can win a single game of my team unlimited with a backcourt of steph and alan iverson like honestly one of those two cards alone would be trouble enough to use against these uh these cheesy opponents but both of them uh, okay i need to start putting my hand up on defense i'm just like wow if i would have just put my hand up on d like one time this game i would be up 11 2 to start i i obviously didn't but look at these look at these passes man oh my goodness manu to the rim and one where where's my and one ref relentless finisher manu what a huge card this series man i love this dude manu boys i'm just conserving a little bit of this face cam battery oh, i sagged off too far this should not be a close game but for whatever reason i'm just i'm not picking up my game against an inferior opponent like it happens sometimes we are going to get this win. You better believe that. Where is that pass go? Okay, it was deflected. But like, I just, my team just does not have the urgency today to absolutely blow this man out. Fair enough. We just got to make sure we don't accidentally choke or something like that. Hito, oh, getting clamped at the rim by uh, Dikembe Mutombo. I guess that makes sense. And he's off-balling as per usual, which is giving me, it's giving me some problems here. Like, look at this. It's just, ah, my gosh. What am I supposed to do? I hate off-balling people. It makes the game not fun. J.R. Smith wide open. There we go. That's what I'm supposed to do. J transition baskets will help beat off ball i'll tell you that much right now bob pettit yes yes bob and what oh my gosh he's getting eaten alive by this dikembe i don't blame him but free throws we will take let's try this again in transition oh hito turco stay there no don't move when you shoot hito dang it man see i'm taking all these moving shots oh it worked <laughs> jr got wide open uh but my players aren't trying to stop and shoot they're moving things like this man it would be a blowout we're up nine though good enough i guess And 
And there we go. Rage quit. What a fitting way to end this video, man. I wasn't commentating too much this game because I knew I was going to win. And my voice is getting a little sore already. That first game, though, that was the epic one of this video. This one, the one we celebrate, boys. Mm. Mm. Cheers. Chocolate milk to celebrate. Oh, yeah. Mm. So glad I bought this yesterday. It's 25% less sugar, though. That's kind of an L. I'm not going to lie. Okay, and we did not get screwed out of a loss, which is good. 12 and 0. Uh, what do we get? 3,000 MT. Crazy tokens. Cool. Uh, we get a pack. Larry Johnson boys oh my goodness so here's what we're gonna do we are gonna open these packs and before we do just keep in mind this season is over next season will start january 1st or as soon as i can get a video out start commenting right now what i should do what changes should i make to this series how can i improve it should we start with manu and larry johnson let me know everything boys i want to see like a thousand comments on this video after of course you compliment me for going 12 and 0 thank you thank you very much in advance but honestly i think what would be fun would be using these cards we earn right like i don't want it to be two stacks so maybe we do something like larry johnson and manu ginobili plus all golds or something to be a challenge that would be that would be interesting there's larry looking amazing as per usual and we get one of these premier award packs i can't believe like they should give you a box seriously 2k you're being a little bit cheap here as dang it <laughs> i was hoping we'd get like you know you know like a diamond or something maybe we put sean bradley in too since we earned him in spin to win honestly you guys let me know everything and anything Thing. This is the lineup we finished with. Obviously, Jimmy Butler and Giannis just joined today, but man, I I'm going to look at my lineup last season because I don't know, this one doesn't seem as OP, but as the years gone by, you know, Tom Gugliota, Hito Turklu, JR, these are Amethyst cards that are essentially diamonds. Like they play so good. And this Marcus Soul, what a stud, man. He was so clutch in some of these later games down the stretch. Manu, man, what can I say? He was huge. I wish you could get stats for like his last 10 games played, but using him, I always average 13 and three like what a man he carried he was definitely the leader for season three man like i said get all your comments in that includes like win reward spin challenge options all that good stuff how should we start with the lineup boys this series is just so much fun and i want you guys to enjoy it as much as you can too so if that means having it your way we'll do it your guys way so be on the lookout for comments you can thumbs up as well i'm thinking i need to incorporate both these cards into my starting lineup next season but hey let me know what you think i'm excited to use this larry johnson man like so ah uh, makes it so worth it to get these cards when you don't cheese like you don't use a bad lineup you really put in the time i'm telling you boys spin to win it's fire and thank you all so much for the support if you happen to just be watching this last video i do have a playlist of all the episodes go back watch season one as well if you're bored and you want to re-watch it straight up netflix binge watch it boys yeah wow okay i'm out of things to say please go ahead drop a thumbs up on this video i'd love to see like 2,000 likes i know that's ridiculous but it would be awesome leave me comments i've said it a million times that's all i got for this one guys oh what a good time what a good time i'm jake canada you all stay golden.